What's good, YouTube, man? It's your boy, Mikey Fisher, man. Today, it's going to be a different video, man. I'm going to show you guys my tackle, what I got rigged up behind me. Basically, all my tackle. I said what I got rigged up behind me, but basically all my tackle. I got my pose right here. But I'm just going to show you all my tackle. I know y'all been asking what um, kind of stuff I use, what kind of stuff I throw, what type of tackle I use, what kind of rise do I have. Get right into it, and I'm going to show you guys my tackle, man. Let's go. We're going to start off with the wall at first. It's nothing special, but we got a couple Google baits here. We got some Zoom, we got some Strike King, we got some Bass Pro, we got some custom lures right there. You know, we got some frogs, but really we just got a bunch of wall of baits, you know, a bunch of different variety variety of baits that we just put up here today. We've actually done this today. So we're gonna bring it over to our daggone boxes. As y'all see, we got the little Google Squad on baits on logo right there, represent. Right in here, we got some on sprinter baits. Like, you know, nothing too special. This is gonna be a quick little video, so y'all just tune in, man. Uh, after that, we got on. We got some chatter baits, a bunch of different chatter baits. We got some ch white chatter baits. We got some some brim color chatter baits. Uh, chartreuse colored. Then on top of that, we got some jigs up here at the top. Y'all see the jig? Um, this is a swim jig from Google Squad. Bunch of different colors. I mean, we're really just sticking to the natural colors, the white chartreuse. We got some green pumpkin, you know, just in really natural colors. We got some black and blue, little football jig. Um, another swim jig right here. But yes, same with the sprinter baits, something natural, something what the fish will like, basically, chartreuse. We also got one that's tied on. That's another one from War Eagle, that's chartreuse. This is a War Eagle. I'm not sure what brand this is, but it works. Uh, this one right here is a Google Swab on um, sprinter bait, but haven't really caught anything off of it. Forgot what color that is. Is it California Crow? I don't really know, but that's our spinner baits. That's our own, um, really our jig box. Hopefully we can upgrade it. Um, we really ain't got much because, you know, we lose a bunch of tackle, but that's our own little jig box, spinner bait box. And we move over to, well, matter of fact, we're going to come down here. Come down here to this plano box, little waterproof plano box. Um, open it up. And as y'all can see, it's a bunch of goodies in here. Bunch of Guggen baits. I love Guggen baits. I love bandito bugs. So I definitely got to have a bunch of banditos. Banditos. So we got the white. We got the green pumpkin. We got the um June bug. A green pumpkin purple. We got watermelon red, black and blue. We got Okeechobee. And we got some bullet weights right there. Uh, we got a little, a couple little hooks. You know, a couple packs of hooks. Terminal tackle. Here, a bunch of bandito bugs. Cause I love Guggen squad being like bandito bugs. They just catch a lot of fish. So. That's what we got in this box right here. You know, we're just gonna zoom on past this, put this back how it was. And then we're gonna move over to this box right here. Y'all probably know what's in this box. Y'all can probably see through it. Cinco's, bunch of different kinds of Cinco's. And also we got some trick worms right here. Some zoom trick worms, a bunch of different colors. Some green pumpkin, some June bug, uh, some spray grass. Uh, I think that's it. And then right here, we got some yum dingers. Uh, those are yum dingers. Those are Yum Dingers. Google Squad Cinco's. These are Gary Yamamoto Cinco's. These are Green Pumpkin Seed, I think. I'm not sure. And also, we got some more Google Squad Cinco's right here. I love Google. Some white Cinco's. And I think these are Yum Dingers right here. It is. This is just a little Cinco box, little worm box. That's about it. You know, waterproof worm box. So, bunch of Cinco's, bunch of trick worms in here. That will catch a lot of fish. So, if y'all ask what I use, that is basically what I use for like worms. But I also got the trick worms up here. I got a bunch of other baits. Move on to the best box that we have here. The best box, Little Lock. It ain't really Little Lock. Well, we just put the the on um, the logo on the represent, man. But yeah, we open this box up. And as y'all see, it is a bunch of frogs, top water. This is basically our top water box. Uh, really nothing special, nothing special about the box. The box is very old, as y'all can tell, you know. But we got a bunch of different variety of baits. Bunch of different top water baits in here. Uh, we got a rattle trap right here. We got some spooks. Another rattle trap under there, I think. Uh, we got some contenders. And then we got a bunch of frogs. I need to get me a frog box. But yeah, as y'all see, we got a bunch of frogs in here, man. Bunch of frogs. Bunch of different kinds of frogs. We got popping frogs. We got walking frogs. Popping frogs. Uh, really? Uh, we got this frog right here. I, I used this like once or twice. Haven't really caught anything off this like paddle uh frog, but... Uh, we also got a scum frog in here. We have we got a bunch of frogs in here. We just have not really caught them. But I love to throw frogs, so that's why I got a bunch of them. 
And also we got some, you know, old Google Squad revolver. We got some more Google Squad stuff in here. Uh, but yeah, that's about it, man. This is like a top water box. Nothing too special, but this is the type of tackle that I use. Bunch of different top waters, couple crank baits here. I lost a couple of different crank baits, but couple crank baits. Uh, this is the stuff that I use though. So yeah, we're gonna close this box up. Put this back where it was. There you go. Put that back where it was. So Y'all see everything. That's really what I use. We got our little two little GoPros right here. You know, our regular GoPro. And then we got the one for my phone. Got some line. Uh, we got some old lures. Guys, now I'm about to show you guys my rods. What kind of rods do I use? Uh, this is not all the rods, but these are the rods that I got, just got outside. But first, we got a Lose Mach 2 with an Abby Garcia Pro Max. Uh, this is a 7 to 1 to 1 gear ratio reel. Um, nothing too special. Uh, actually, this Lose rod. Sorry, my, my aunt got me this rod, but I kind of uh, broke the tip twice on this rod at the very top. But um, still love you. Um, but yeah. Uh, that's pretty much what we got on. We got, uh, what do we have on? We got a little jerk bait, soft plastic jerk bait. But yeah, this is Abby Garcia, little low profile reel, about 60, 70 bucks. It was my two rod. That's like, I forgot how much the rod is. Maybe, maybe like $80 now. I'm not sure. Um, so let's move on. Spinning rods on combo. A little setup. We got a cast king reel. Uh, I think this is a five, uh, it's five to two to one. I figured that was what it was. It's five to two to one reel. Uh, a Berkeley lightning rod for about 40 bucks. 50 bucks, you know, nothing too special. We catch a bunch of fish on light equipment, on cheap equipment as well. And we got on a little um, finesse trick worm or finesse worm, not trick worm, finesse worm with a little weight on. Let's move on. That's some light tackle, nothing really special. This rod that we actually is another cheap rod that's made from David Dudley. It's, a, it's one of his series rods. And it's a Pro Fishy Rod 7.2, medium heavy. Uh, we got a Lose Mach 2 from the Lose Mach on um, the Lose Mach 2 rod. That was a combo, but I switched it up, you know. But we got the Pro Fishing Reel, I mean rod. We got the Lose Mach 2 reel. Uh, this reel is a 75 to 1, so this is a faster reel, if you would say. You guys want a good reel for the price, the Lose Mach 2. Uh, it was pretty good, so that's what I got on. And I got on a Whopper Flopper, you know the vibes. Got on some 50 pound braid, Whopper Flopper. That is what we got on today. And then, who was to the addition. Got the SLX DC. SLX DC, this, this new chip. Favorite ride, USA, seven foot medium heavy. And they also have a sale right now, Labor Day sale. So if y'all wanna go check them out, Labor Day sale, go check them out. They got a bunch of um, rides on sale. So, and I also caught like two or three different rides yesterday. So y'all go check them out. Lose on, um, we got an SLX DC reel. The reel's amazing. Uh, I really don't know the gear ratio is seven to two. I don't really know the ratio, but on reels, they're amazing. We got it for like 180, but I didn't really, mm, you know, got it for like 180, but it was okay. Uh, and we got the favorite ride. You know, I love favorite. So favorite USA, go check them out. Labor Day sale, seven foot, medium heavy. Let's go. But yeah, that's probably gonna conclude this video, man. Hope y'all stay tuned for more. Y'all like, subscribe, turn on post notifications. Make y'all share this video. It's a little, my tackle video. Nothing's too special, but make sure y'all let them fly. Hook them all, you know the vibes, man. About to get out of here, so. Doses, everybody be safe. Boom.